What's up guys and welcome back to my channel and another video sponsored by Light Elegance. In this video, we are going to talk about the amazing Manicure. This gel is perfect to use for natural nails because it is extremely flexible and it gives you that feeling of a gel polish manicure but stronger and it lasts longer. Let's talk about my nails to start with. So my nails have been taking a beating for sure. Been wearing my long nails for a long, long time. Been very uncareful with them. So I decided that it is time for them to get a little bit of rest. I'm still gonna have gel on them. It's just that I wanna cut down on the length because the length is what has caused damage to my own nails because I haven't been careful enough. So I figured that manicure would be the perfect option for me to use to get me that light and natural feeling. Here I'm using Vita Prime and moving on to the amazing tack and I'm just gonna put that straight over that little <clears throat> crack and after that we're actually gonna apply silk on top of it so if you have a smaller crack you could definitely just go in with the light elegance fiber gel but since this is such a huge crack going through the nail i need some of this right here and this is as i said called um silk you can get it probably in most nail supply stores i guess and we're gonna use that together with manicure. So first off, I'm just gonna apply one thin coat over the entire nail. And then as you can see here, I'm placing that silk on top of the nail and then I'm just making that part wet. I'm not gonna cure until I have actually all the nails covered with some manicure. And another little fun fact about the manicure is that it's actually soakable as well. So you get the strength from the hard gel, but you also have the option of soaking it if that is something you prefer. So now the nails are cured and I'm just gonna move on to the next step and that is to kind of encapsulate this silk piece. This next step is optional. You don't have to build up the nails if you wanna have a natural look or just a feeling of having a thin gel polish manicure. I think this is more like a European way to do it, to kind of just build up the nails and making a tiny, tiny... I wouldn't really go out and say apex, but almost. It's just that you get a nicer shape of the nail. So that is maybe a little bit more European. And don't worry, my nails look way worse than they are. Uh, as you can see here, one half of the nail is one color and then the other half of the nail is another color. And that happens because when you have material on your nail, that part that has been covered with gel is still very, very moistured. So that's why it has a different color than the rest of the nail. After a while, that's just gonna even out on its own, but it looks way worse than it is. So right now I am moving on to my favorite color in the entire world, your churn buttercream and if you haven't tried out buttercreams before you need to try it out because as you can see this goes on in one single coat and it is so 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 thin and another thing that is super important when you are working with short nails like this just a short overlay is that you cap the free edge with every single layer that you do so even if it's the manicure tack the color the super shiny whatever it could be just remember that if you want to have the option of soaking the manicure off you need to know that the buttercream itself is not soakable. So you would have to take a file and then very quickly just remove that. And as you can see, because it is so, so thin, it's gonna take you like two seconds and then you can soak the rest of the nail off. So now moving on to some design because I am right now really into like minimalistic kind of styles. So here I'm actually using the back of my gel polished bling brush and I dipped it into my gel paint. The dots get a little bit bigger than if you were to use like a regular dotting tool. 
So moving on to super shiny and this is very satisfying to watch. And as you can see here, I am making sure to cap the free edge to avoid any type of separation. So here you have the finished result and this is just a perfect easy fast manicure for those type of clients that request like a gel polish feeling but will last way longer and it's so much stronger. So hopefully you enjoyed this tutorial and I will see you in the next one. Take care guys. Mwah.